Japanese cocktails. I'm actually back for another fall cocktail for you. Um, I'm feeling in the season. Apple, pumpkin. I just got my hands on a pumpkin cider today, which I'm really excited about. Not related to the drink I'm making, but I'm in the fall spirit. So I want to make another fall cocktail for you. So today I'm going to be making um, the generically named um, bourbon apple cider bourbon cocktail. So I need a better name for that. But when I found the recipe on Pinterest, that's literally what they call it. So I need something better. So I'm open to suggestions on what we officially would call this drink. So um, it's a very easy drink that anybody can make. You just need some apple cider and some bourbon. Um, so I'm gonna actually start off with a rocks glass today or some sort of smaller glass. And I'm gonna um, rim the glass first. And I'm actually, I poured some apple cider into a, a plate here. And I'm gonna wet the, rim my glass with it. And then this is a sugar and cinnamon mixture. I just did 50-50. Um, which will, it, anytime you rim the glass, it just, it adds to the flavor of your drink, whether it's salt or sweet, and um, it makes it look really cute too. So I've got that, and I'm going to add a little ice to it. You want to put the ice in after, obviously. All right, so move these out of the way. Okay, so um, I've just got a mixing glass here. You could also do this in a shaker. It doesn't really matter. Um, you want to have some bourbon. So I'm going to do two shots of bourbon. I'm, today I'm using Old Forester Statesman, which I got from the Old Forester Distillery in Louisville. It's really good stuff. So again, two shots of that. And you know, I love the fall season. I love fall drinks. I love fall foods. Uh, I'm not loving this fall weather that's still been in the 80s here in Indiana. Um, not high 80s or anything, but just warm enough to where it's annoying. You know, we still have to mow the lawn. Um, still wearing shorts. Like, it's definitely not, like, hoodie weather, jeans weather, any of that. So, definitely ready for the weather to cool off a little bit. Um, I've got some honey crisp apple cider that I got from the store today. Any kind of cider would work. I like a little sweet one, so I got this. We're going to do four shots of that. Basically, you just want to do double of whatever you did with the shots of bourbon. And you could always adjust that. This one, to me, when I tried it, it was a pretty good combination um, for it wasn't too strong, but you could probably go a little heavier on the bourbon if you wanted. All right, that's it, two ingredients. I'm gonna give this a nice stir, nice and chilled. Grab my glass. Now I did, I researched a few drinks and one of them was like, you can have this hot or cold. That was a different drink, but I suppose you could warm these because you know, I've done bourbon and hot drinks before too. So whatever you prefer, I'm doing it iced. Just pour it over your ice. Perfect amount with the glass. And I'm gonna garnish with a rosemary stem. I have some, this is my third rosemary drink. I, I still have some left, so I thought, well, I might as well use it. And a cinnamon stick, nice and festive. All right, now if you don't like apple cider, this is not the drink for you. Um, you know, Gabe's not a big cinnamon fan, but he still liked this drink. So even, you know, you don't have to do the cinnamon on the rim or whatever, but um, it's very good flavors for fall. So let me give this a little try here. Mm, it's really good. Um, it's very sweet. It's a very sweet cocktail. Um, there's not really a way to take that down. Um, I, this is something, if you're wanting a sweet cocktail with some bourbon in it, this is perfect for this time of year. Like I said, I think you probably could do a warm version of this. Obviously, no ice involved. Um, you could probably still rim the glass and everything, warm it up maybe on the stove. I don't know. I, I'm not really into that as much. I will be once it gets colder out, but this is a perfect drink for this weather, especially for our unseasonably warm fall. So, um, again, this is generically called a... Um, I forgot the name of it. Apple Cider Bourbon Cocktail. New name, TBD. Have a great weekend, guys.